That was a coincidence. What? The knife. It just happened to go into the exact right spot. You do not get a win for dumb luck. Look, if that's the way you choose to see the world, then so be it. But don't you dare try to take this away from me. I've been coming in here every day for 24 years, watching children die and seeing good people suffer. And if I quit believing that there was a bigger plan behind all this, well, I just wouldn't be able to show up tomorrow. So just stop it. I'm sorry. It's OK. You'd be surprised how many bad things happen around here for a reason. I wish I could believe that. It was awful that Jordan had to have prenatal surgery. But how have you two been since then? I'm really glad I have you. Better than ever. Good night. So maybe sometimes bad things do happen for a reason. Like your hot nanny getting fired. Chuck, look at this! You know, for a half-breed baby, your parents have some pretty nice stuff. She was a racist thief. Smoking hot racist thief. You look pretty. Or how getting suspended can get a relationship back on track. Dr. Reed! Consider your suspension over. That said, you're still a ridiculous excuse for a doctor. He talked to me. Or how facing a tough situation can bring you closer together. How's that, baby? She's hanging in there. Be careful, though, because around here, if you start believing that bad things happen for a reason, it hurts that much more when they don't. What's with all the sad faces? Laverne was in a car accident on her way to work. She's in a coma and unresponsive. There ain't no reason things are this way. Is how they always been in the end to stay. I can't explain why we live this way. We do it every day.